been kind of waiting for a, a real barn burner. Adam. Oh, I know, man. We have. Uh, we feel like we've done a good job of picking games, but man, we have not had a had any close ones, have we? We haven't. I'd be surprised if this one wasn't to the wire tonight. So it's interesting when they change districts. You know, obviously we had Coach Jones on uh, on your podcast in the summer, and he talked about moving to that Eastern District. I kind of like that. I think it's cool that they do that. They pull some teams from the Metropolitan area. I mean, obviously you have to based on numbers, but um, not a normal matchup. You get a lot of matchups that you commonly wouldn't see. I think some districts feel like doing it differently. Like we've separated UConn and Mustang. We mm -hmm. separated some of the Moore schools. or The Moore schools are together for the first time ever. And this one's going to be brought out of the end zone. And the Eagles get a good stop inside the 20-yard line where McAllister will take over first and 10. Diddy, they've got to make a trip to Altus and – Double tight for the Buffaloes. And it's McCarty as the quarterback takes the snap and runs for a gain of four. Out of the ring to go yeah. hit the bull. I'm not yeah. sure that he's a really a bull. I would say he's more of a, more of a sacrificial lamb. <laughs> McCarty, again, that is good defense from the Eagles. He is stacked up right at the line of scrimmage, but he's right in the middle. Tight into the left, and McCarty offset to the right. Going to throw it back, and we got a penalty flag on the play. Dell City does a really nice job of stopping this. He is split out of the backfield. Leno, the quarterback, is rolling to his right, and he is tackled, and that's another loss of one in the Dell City defense. Kalster will punt from a spread formation, and it's a good one. Braylon Adama, the Dell City running back, is there to field at the that's 15. Been turnable. Builds it on the run, and he's into open space. He's at the 35, and we have a penalty flag thrown. Yeah, it's taking him a while to get into the game, and he probably is watching the contest. It's, uh, it's going to be a good one. Godwin hands it Big off. Roll. Good tackle. And that was a great tackle. A lot of speed on the outside in this offense. Godwin trying to elude some defenders and Man, gets past fast. the couple, and there goes the speed. And Godwin is able to scramble from the 41. Bouncing oh, nice. outside. There goes Adama. And Adama is going to have the first down. He is on the defensive side of the ball oh. at Oklahoma. Snap is high. Got a flag down, too. Clock running 6.42 to go in the first quarter. Quick pass is thrown and another good tackle made by McAllister. This is a team that really is solid and really good. Crowd on the visitor sidelines here. Godwin drops back to pass, throwing it over the got middle. Him. He's got a man and it's a strike and the Eagles score first. 44 yards out. Kanigel Thomas is behind the defense. It's him of Michael Vick. He can just fly and make things happen, and that was a great deep ball against man coverage. Put it right on the dot, too. Extra point is good. All right, welcome back. Mark Rogers, Adam Diesel, horse 7-0, Dell City. Big third down and 10 connection from DeKalen Godwin to Knigel Thomas, and the Eagles will kick it back off to the Buffaloes. Got a shout-out from uh, the Todd Miller from Little Rock, Arkansas. He told, told me to tell you hello, Mark. One that it, it, it's difficult to, you know, I don't think they find themselves behind very often. Sure. But And I'm sure they can throw the football as well. It, it's just a, it's a very talented team. And there's a nice run and also a good fumble, tackle. Fumble. The ball is out, and it looks like yep. Dell City's got it. Wow, what a play. <laughs> Buffalo territory. Godwin rolls out, fakes the handoff to Adama. Oh, wow. He's going deep again, and he's got his man. Down to the four-yard line, pass thrown to Tango McCauley, another one of the big physical receivers. Quickly back up in the line, handoff to Adama. Adama spinning, churning towards the end zone. He's going to be stopped short. And there we go, touchdown. Eagles score. It's Demarion Turner. In for the touchdown, and it is now 13-0. From DeKalen Godwin to Tango McCauley, and the extra point pending. 
It is now, let's see, that was a missile. It is good. 14-0, Dell City over McAllister. Welcome back. Eagles will kick it off for the third time tonight. And the ball is right down the middle of the field. Buffs have a man going down the oh. boundary. And there he is goes. gone. He's into gone. the clear. And that is a touchdown. That's the fastest way to get back into this contest for McAllister. Blaze Ball, the junior, taking it 80 yards for a touchdown. Snap is down, hold is good, extra point is good. 14-7, 436 to go. We had 21 points scored in the last minute. And High kick is taken at the 20-yard line and fumbled. And oh, the Eagles have nice. had a couple of really rough special teams plays. They're going to take over at the 16-yard line. McAllister did a good job of covering that kick. That. Adama breaks free into the clear. Big stick right next to the first down marker. He'll take it to the 25-yard line for a gain of nine. It's just, hey, keep picking up first downs. Gives you at least three more attempts before I have to think about a punt. Here goes Godwin around the right side. He's at the 35-yard line before he goes out of bounds. Very difficult to tackle. Looks to me so far, Adam, that the Eagles have an advantage in the speed department. Godwin nice double move. under pursuit and just throws the ball away. Handoff. And good defense by the Buffaloes. It is McCarty over there to finish him off. Also initial contact by Braden Bumpus. Godwin facing only a three-man rush. The Buffalo's dropping everyone back. This can be a dangerous proposition against a guy that can run like this. But great tackle nice. in the open field at the 39-yard line to thwart what would be another potential scamper and long run for the Eagles. Oh, Ooh, it blocked. It was, I, I don't, can we call that blocked? It was just yeah. basically scold is what it was. It looked yeah. like maybe a three-iron that I would hit. It was just off the ground. And it was McCarty who got through there the 46-yard line, first and 10. Momentum has switched. Obviously, Dell City had all that momentum early on, but McAllister with a big run. The Buffs are going to like to run this clock. That's a four-yard gain by McCarty. Vision one operation. McCarty in the single wing. Plows forward. The Dell City defense is really not giving up much. Look at this. Look at that pile go. Diamond formation with McCarty. Taking the snap. Oh, there's a big stop. Big stop on third down. Costly penalty for the Eagles. Same formation. We'll see if they can get him again. Ooh, look at this. McCarty's under center. And look at the pile move oh again. This is impressive. Gain of eight. 20 took Poto to the state semifinals and took McAllister to the state finals a year ago. Touchdown pass from Godwin to Thomas. The Eagles got right back after it. One yard run from Damari and Turner. And a big kickoff return. And that's great defense. Looks like McCarty's getting a little bit of a breather here. Playing both ways. Played a lot of snaps. Yeah, he has. It's Blaze Ball in the backfield. Ball takes it, has some running room, powers forward to the 25-yard line. We'll give him a gain of five. Brings up third down at five. Lane talked about it on the Pick'em Show Tuesday night. No, quarterback drops back. Got a man wide open. Touchdown. What an executed play by 
the Buffaloes, and it's the big play threat out of the backfield. Blaze Ball, who hauls in the 30-yard pass. Some play action deception. They fake the handoff to Ball. Here come the Eagles in that quick huddle formation. Different look this time. Blaze Ball is tackled and stopped. Good stop. The Eagles get penetration and hit Ball in the backfield and a couple of big licks taken by, well, is that McCarty? Kick straight up in the air. They'll force the Eagles to make a play, taking it to the 25-yard line. And some running room for Adama. Flip on motion. And coming this way with it for the Eagles is Damarian Turner. Godwin rolling to his right. Has a man in the flat. Caught and out of bounds. Tango McCauley. Tough to contain, and he can fire missiles from that spot. Big stop from McAllister. They get some penetration on the handoff. They're going to call Godwin's number. Ooh, oh, goodness. he gets just drilled. Just drilled. What a hit. That's number nine. Big hit from the Buffaloes. Owen Russell, the linebacker, and he... Hit Godwin square on. Quarterback keeper in the wing. Moving a lot of personnel around in the backfield. Now they've got number 12 at quarterback. It's Lance Stone. Big body guy. Oh. Stone breaks free. Is that short yardage formation? You know what that reminds me of? That reminds me of the of the of the Morrison stuff. Different formations from both teams. Like, there's your guy. Uh, there's Baugh. Blaze Baugh from the 43-yard line, now deep into Dell City territory, the Buffaloes. There's again around the left side. This is not as much running room. Gains a couple. Yeah. Second down and 14. Play action pass. Nice. Got a little screen Ooh. drawn up. That's good defense to hold on. That ball came out late. Uh, that's got to be a completed pass, I would think. Let's see how the officials rule this one. Well, Mark, and I don't know if you noticed from here, but they had that play set up. Godwin. Oh, what a block. Going to still try to throw this down the field. He had a couple of guys running in the same spot. I mind Tim Bart, who actually had been retired out of coaching. He used to coach at Moore and coached at uh, Bartlesville. Had some really good basketball teams back in the day. He is at uh, Claremore, Sequoia now. And uh, he said the basketball team that they're going to have this year, some more stops. But this is about what we expected here with four minutes to go in the half. Good punt. Really is a good punt over the head of the Buffaloes. And that changes field position. It goes from your 26-yard line all the way to the opponent's 20. And so that's a welcome sight for the special teams. And for McAllister, offset eye. Hand off to the first man through. And how about this Dell City defensive front? They are doing a commendable job. But nothing in the second quarter. Ooh, good play. Fake to McCarty, and Lesnow, the quarterback, keeps it and runs around the end. Uh, Dell City had good pursuit there. We wanted a uh, competitive, close game. and well, When it was 14 to nothing, I thought it might have jinxed us. But I, I think we're in good shape. Here I they come with that formation again. And it, that... Dell City is doing a great job defending it. They are. Your favorite item today at the Greek Festival. Well, I tried to have some food discipline because there were a lot of desserts there that I could have gone <laughs> to town on. I heard uh, you talking to Trotter. and he's A baklava <laughs> sundae. I've had it before. Stupid good. Uh, so I did go with the saganaki, the, the flaming cheese, 10 to 10, then uh, Sunday 11 to 4. You will not be disappointed. Plenty of food, plenty of drink, plenty of uh, good times. 
I've never had Greek food, but the way you explained it on the radio today, it sounds like I enjoy it. Look at this Dell City defensive line getting back there to make the play. On that white. I think it would look a lot better than the gold. Gold trim on a black number. McCall McAllister gets an F for can't see. Yes, I can't see them. Those jerseys are garbage. I'm sorry. They may look good, and the kids may like them, but they're bad for the fans and bad for the announcers. I'm guessing that Dr. Bellotero doesn't have you read gold numbers as one of the things. I agree with you. They got a lot of guys in coverage. And they just move up. Oh, fumble. A, expecting a run there. I think Del City gets back on top, although McAllister says they've got it. And Del City does get back on top of it. Evers to the right of Godwin, one to the left. Going underneath, Ball. what a great pass. Caught a bunch of McAllister defenders right there, but not before a gain of over 20 on an absolute missile. Godwin bobbles it. Three-man rush, finds his man, nice. what a play! And the Eagles bounds. will try to get out of bounds. They have no time. They're going to have to hurry up to get on the ball here. But they, I, mean, I, I, I think if they, they feel pretty good about this. If there's point, if yeah. you get points here, there's True. something to be said for that. There could be things go wrong if you're trying to uh, get back there. That kick looks Real good. Up. Ooh, nope, he missed it. This is absolutely the definition of a prevent defense here for Dell City. This is a 3-1-7 formation. <laughs> and the Buffaloes take a knee. We'll go to half with them right now. And yeah, you don't even feel like you're in Oklahoma. It is beautiful down there. Absolutely. Yeah, Mark, you talked about McCarty. I mean, look at him. He's also on kickoff, too. I mean, that's, you know, he I, want, wants to be out there. If you, uh, yeah, I mean, a, a player that's that good, and I would want him to be out there, too, if, if I'm Forrest Maisie. Oh, we got our kickoff return here. Big run by Kanigel Thomas. You can see why K-State's interested in him as well. I mean, he has that receiver, game breaker. For nine, the linebacker. Well, he had one of the bigger hits in the contest so far. Adama Ooh, gets it right up the middle. Oh, Fumbles fumble. a football. It's loose. And Dell City is going to, let's see, almost fall on it. Well, no, he did scoop that up. That was a smart play by Josiah Burris. Adama. Doesn't have any running room along the left side. About four McAllister Buffaloes that meet him right after the handoff. Godwin, straight back, four-man rush, oh. and he trips and falls. And the Buffaloes have been bringing three-man pressure most of the game. Gained it a net 12. Mm -hmm. Let's throw it up to one, right? It's another, this is a three-man rush with a spy. There goes the spy Ooh, with a big a hit. Decision. Throws an interception. Picked off by the Buffaloes. I think we're going to have a block in the back. But that was the late pressure coming in from the Buffalo spy. One of the season for El Reno. 5A has got some crazy scores tonight. There's the Dell City defensive line standing up. don't know that 6-3 is, is accurate, but he is a player. Oh, he fumbled it. He did fumble it, and the ball is still on the ground. Looks Del like Dell City's, City's got, got it. it. That is the second fumble deep in their own territory for McAllister. Two minutes and 49 seconds of elapsed here in the second quarter. Quick pass, caught at the 18-yard line, tackled from behind, and a gain of about five or six for the Eagles on the short pass is ridiculous. Enid scores again to go up 32-21 over Moore. Eagles are taking their time. Godwin gets the snap at one. Fakes the handoff, Ooh. runs through the middle of the defense, and he is past the 10, or excuse me, past the 15, and will be very, very close here. It's a first down. Handoff goes to Adama, and again, not much running room for a touchdown. And Adama falls down as he crosses the line of scrimmage at the eight-yard line. Let's see, motion now to the left. Three receivers. Change the strength of the side. Godwin is stopped right at the five-yard line. He'll lose a yard. And Adam, like you said, try to get to the outside. He goes in there where the big guys have been tough all night. And again by McAllister, great answer. They've been in two bad spots here early on in this quarter and made two huge stops so far. 
Snaps good. The hold's down. That kick looks good. Yep. It's good. Take a look ahead to next week. There's some really good ball games out there. Deer Creek and Choctaw, I believe. That's a Thursday game uh, in Choctaw. Union and Mustang, another game next Friday. Check on the Mustang score against Owasso. Might be a tough task for the Broncos to hang in there with Union. Buffaloes have already had a big kick return for a touchdown, but the Eagles get this one stopped. Week. He will be. Just play action to nobody, and it ended up working out. I don't know if that was a busted play, but it's a big gain for Caden Lesno. Here's my goodness. Lesno rolls out, has his man Ball. caught. Carter Lance on the reception, gain of about seven. Now, obviously, Del City's, Del City's had the better hand here recently defensively. Boy, that Ooh, is wow. tough physical run. Ball, Ball came out. out again. Still going to be McAllister's ball, but I think it did. You got improved teams at Edmond. You got a very much improved team at Enid. Third down and two to go. McCarty. He's got it. Powers for the first down. Hit right at the mark. I assume wrong. First and ten. Lesnow under heavy pressure, Good and he tackle. falls down. Great play from the Eagles, number 12, Deshaun McAllister, the sophomore. Clock running, 2.19 to go in the third. McCarty Nothing gets it, doing. falls forward. Definitely fits the bill. McCarty gets it, and he is stopped in he his fumbled. tracks. So, good field position for Dell City. Godwin, look at Ooh. him slip through just a little crease. New running back Adama. in the game. Well, that's not Adama. Yeah. Good move and good reversal of field. I believe that's number two, right? Damari and 28. Turner. 28? Yep. Shaden Green, sophomore. Godwin. Oh, goodness. Gets through, breaks through the line of scrimmage at the 20. Down to the 15, so fast and able to. That's Adama back in the game at the tailback spot, and that dive play handoff has just not worked. Credit to the defensive front things, you're correct. Four receivers to the right, one to the left. Godwin facing a three-man rush. He's got plenty of time. Here's where he's dangerous. Oh, and there's going to be a hold. big uh, hit stopping right at the 12-yard line. It's I believe that is 82. Stanley Johnson in for the kick. Boy, that was a bad snap and Not a good it. hold. And the field goal is good. So that extends the lead to a touchdown and extra point here with 10-12 to go. All right, welcome back. 10-12 to go. Should be an exciting conclusion here in the fourth quarter. Dell City, a couple of field goals in the second half is all the scoring we've had. And they lead 20 to 13. Dell City special teams. See if they lose containment. Good and tackle. they don't. Big, big hit for Damarian Turner, the sophomore. We've called his name a few times tonight. Lesnow drops back to pass. Throwing one up Ooh, deep. Great adjustment and caught. There goes McCarty. He's in the open field. This is where he's dangerous. Have a chance to watch his huddle tape here. Isle runner that he is too. He wears on you after a while too. Flag flies. That's good defense by Carter. Power formation with two tight ends. They just snap it directly to McCarty. And he's doing his best, but he is not able to gain much. Dell City has 11 men within five yards of the line of scrimmage. McCarty gets the first down against that type of defense. Wow. Even against this two wide formation, is going to stick all of its players right up next to the line of scrimmage. Nothing there. Oof. That is a big physical tackle. Carter Swanson diving at the, or Cal Swanson at the pylon. What a play! 
They get to the quarterback. Great play by Braylon Adama. Oh, wow, they're going to fake it again. Well, no, they thought about it. That was a better decision. Ooh, he could be gone. What a run. Adama. Adama somehow gets through a maze of players. Adama, no rest for the weary. Gets the handoff and is pushed back. A little bit of an advantage to them, but they have been deliberate when they've needed to be. Run blitz. Ooh, nice Adama cut. sneaks through. McCarty barely tripped him up. Yeah, just literally just right down the road. Quarterback. Godwin can't fool them. They give McAllister a little taste of their own medicine. That's Damari and Turner in and the Wildcat formation. McAllister backs out. Handoff. Ooh. Tough running room and a gain to the five. Just one, it looks like. Good snap. Got it. Good hold. It's good. And for the first time since early in this ball game, they've you know, not made very many mistakes. They've been confident in the kicking game and and it just stifled McAllister. Other than the, the he is a, a junior, people need to keep their eye on. Same pass. Ooh. They scored a touchdown on the first half, and it's good. That's McAllister. McCarty catches the pass out of the backfield, and he is gone for 80 yards and hold everything. It worked early. Yeah. High snap, and the kick is still good. And for the third time. I believe it hit the defender. And looks like looks like McAllister may have this one. I thought it hit the Did they the touch it before player, it went yeah. 10 yards? This is this is the big decision because McAllister came up with the football. Did they touch it before it went 10 yards? I thought it hit the kicker, but the officials are conferring on this. What a big, big call. And we're going to talk it all over between everybody. Yeah, I thought the I thought the kicker it bumped up against his shoulder pad, but yeah, they're not going to give it to him. Here's the call. Legal touching. I think that's the right call. Yeah, it was. Adama is going to take the handoff, and he fumbled it. Oh my goodness. Oh, my goodness, McAllister's going to get it anyway. Yep, they are. Wow. Wow. Screen pass. It's there. It's set up. Big run and out of bounds. Stops the clock after a gain of 15. Motion. Another screen. Screen to McCarty. Oh, he wow. Breaks a tackle. He's out in the open. He oh breaks another goodness. tackle. What oh a my run goodness. from Eric McCarty. Oh he runs goodness. through the entire Dell City defense. He goes 50 yards to the house, and McAllister has risen from the ashes to take the lead here with a minute five to go. So once again, from the 31-yard line, left-footed kicker Stanley Johnson looking to go four or five. Snap is a little short. Kick is up. Drilled it. It's good. Six seconds left. Tied at 26. 35 over more. Let's see where this kick goes. Well, that may be headed towards the back of the end zone. That's wow, another what a option. Kick. Well, let's see what the Buffs decide to do. We've seen this formation before this evening. And there goes McCarty. And there goes McCarty, and he is not down until he's down. Finally <laughs> down. That'll do it. Got a lot left to decide. 26 for McAllister. 26 
Cordell City from the 10-yard line. Hate the high school overtime, but here's what we have. Godwin keeps it. The eight bounce backwards there. Got loud over there for a minute. Godwin with Adama to his right. Hands it off to Adama. Oh, he's he's clear into the end zone. Touchdown, Dell City. The Eagles go on top, 6 nothing. Godwin sold the fake. Adama took the handoff and rumbled through the middle of the McAllister defense. Snap high, kick up, kick is good. Of course it's good. The backfield and then one incredible run by number one for McAllister. McCarty it gets it, running left, got a caravan. Bulldozing oh, over defenders. Did he get in? He's at the one. He just rolled on top of the defender. You know, they've been so impressive in that quick, this formation right here tonight. I, I think I'm fine with just this. This is tough to stop. They go under center. McCarty has it. Takes a step back yep, near in. the goal line. No signal yet. No signal yet. They've they stopped. They didn't him. get him. This has been an <laughs> impressive effort from Mike, the PA address here at Dell City. McCarty under center. Look, he fumbled Bad it. snap. Bad snap. No signal. He's, He's in. in. McCarty somehow got in after it looked like he bobbled the snap under center. And he gets going to take the snap out of the diamond backfield. McCarty gets it running to his left with the caravan. He is in. in. McAllister comes to Dell City and wins and probably in overtime, 34-33. You can live three lifetimes, Adam. He may not see a better game than this. I mean, that game, wow. And, I mean, look at McCarty. He is exhausted. And he got hit hard, too, right at the goal line. Man, what an impressive game and a impressive performance across the board. Both of these teams... Just incredible.